Hey, this is Mrs. Nelson. I want to show you how to set up a test with Quizlet flashcards. Uh, testing yourself after you've practiced them with your flashcard for a while and you've gone through each of your words is an excellent thing to do to ensure that you really do know these words, that you're not just recognizing them based on the order or other things like that. So when it's embedded, or even if you're on the website, you can choose the study mode. So I'm going to click that drop down box. So I'm over here in the lower right hand corner. Click that uh, drop down box and choose test. So it creates a test automatically where it, for example, has you type the answer stealing means thieving, which is on this picture. Um, but then that checks your spelling. And I don't really care about your spelling on these vocab. You're trying to master the vocab words. So we're actually going to adjust the test. So we're going to come up here to this dark blue bar and go all the way to the side to those adjustable dial uh, images. So we're going to click on that. I don't want written answers because that just tests spelling. And I don't necessarily want true or false questions. I think they're kind of tricky. And another thing that I would uncheck is show images because I don't want the picture to give away what it is. I want to focus on the words and associating the words with the meaning. So I'm going to uncheck that. That means my test, my test is going to have nine questions and it's only going to be matching and multiple choice. And my, I want to answer with the term, so I'm not going to change that. I don't want to have to type out the definition exactly as it is. So click create new test. Again, we just want matching checked and multiple choice checked and nothing else should be checked right here. And now I have a test that's made up of five multiple choice, or excuse me, five matching questions and four multiple choice questions. So devastation means complete destruction. So I type a B to match those up. Resourceful means good at thinking of ways to do things. So I type an A and match that up. And then I would finish the test and click check answers. And I can see which ones I got right and which ones I got wrong. And I got those wrong because I didn't even bother answering those. The cool thing is, is you can make another test. You can come right back up here and click create new test. And notice the first word is branded. The words have changed and the test has changed. So you can do these tests as many times as you need to make sure that you really understand this vocabulary and that you can associate the meaning with those words, which will help you understand the stories that you're reading each week, the text that you're reading each week in your language arts program. So again, this is your Quizlet uh, vocabulary. This is on our ELA uh, page in um, our language arts course. So you'll find those each week, um, ways to practice those. Change right back to flashcards way to practice those each week. This is what's going to look like by default. And then we can choose other uh, study modes as well. All right, well, thanks for watching. Let me know if you have any questions.